Hi guys, today we will be discussing about what is research and the various terminologies related to research. Let's see. Hi, welcome. What is research? Research is searching for information anywhere which can be of any use to you. That is research. Research may two things can happen. Either the information is already available or you have to know about it. Already available, like for example, uh, say the income of people. Already their income is, you have to know about how much it is. And for example, say in medical sciences, you have to know about what reasons are for a particular disease. It is already available, you need to find it out. So research may be something which is already available or research may be something which you still need to find out or diagnose. Let's have a look at various terminologies which are used in research. Population. What is population? Population is something which uh, we want to study. The area of study. It is also known as universe. Population can be of two types, finite population and infinite population. Population is something which you want to carry out research about. Say for example, you want to carry out a research on uh, the leaves of this tree. Now can you count the number of leaves in the tree? You cannot. So it is a case of infinite population. What about finite population? Finite population is something which you can count. Say if I say I want to carry out a research in a hotel where there are 200 employees. So this is the case of finite population. We denote this finite population by capital N. Mm. Extremely yummy. Now we come to sample. Sample is a part of the population. You select some items from the population. It can be a large sample or it can be a small sample. Small sample we denote it by the number of items which are less than 30. Sample size is denoted by small n. When your sample size is less than 30, it is called a small sample. If it is greater than 30, it is called a large sample. Let's discuss about what is parameter and what is statistic. Parameter, as the name indicates, it is a calculation a value which is calculated for the population say for the population if you've calculated the average so that will be termed as a parameter and any value which you calculate for the sample is known as statistic for example we have 20 items in the sample and you take out the average marks of those 20 people so those average marks will be known as statistic Whereas if you work out the average of the whole population, say 200 students were there in the class. So that average will be termed as parameter. Hypothesis. What is this term hypothesis? Yes, you are right. Hypothesis is something which you assume at the beginning of your research. Like uh, you make an assumption when you start a research. Say I need to make an assumption about the population of a particular city that uh, the literacy level of that population. So I can make an assumption, maybe there are many schools in the city so I can make an assumption that yes, maybe 80% of the population is literate. You can make that assumption. So when you make any assumption for any population, we call that assumption ko hum kehte hai, hypothesis. There are two ways of making assumption. Null hypothesis or alternate hypothesis. is something which is unbiased as a researcher agar mujhe kuch knowledge nahi hai mujhe kuch nahi pata is city mein kitne schools hain kya hai mujhe kuch bhi nahi pata to mera assumption kya hoga that is my null hypothesis this alternate alternate hypothesis is what is going on in my mind whatever information i have so on the basis of that information what is that I want to inquire about? I think that 80% of the are literate. So that is my alternate hypothesis. But if I don't know any information, then in that case, the assumption will be null hypothesis. Now we come to the last one. So we have done with some of the terminologies in research. And 
In the part 2 of this video, we will be looking forward towards more terminologies which are used in research. Don't forget to like and subscribe my video.